have a Kodi or looking to get it? How about sending a VPN on it? Let me show you how to do that in this video. But before we start, remember to hit that like button, subscribe to our YouTube channel for more cybersecurity videos. So what is Kodi? Let me tell you what it is first in case you do not know. And of course, if you want to skip to the setup part, just click on the timestamps below. Kodi is an open source entertainment software. It is mostly used to expand the capabilities of your smart TV. You see, depending on what kind of TV you have, it may not necessarily be that smart. Older Samsung TVs running Tizen OS or LG TVs with WebOS are very limited in the features run. Kodi can completely transform it by adding features like streaming and playing movies with advanced controls adding the ability to completely customize your TV's UI with custom skins and backgrounds. It also acts as your entertainment center and serves all the media that you watch from different sources in one place. In addition, Kodi also has something called Kodi add-ons. These add even more features and services to Kodi. Okay, cool. So how can you use Kodi? Simply head over to Kodi.tv and download the software for your respective device. You may notice that there is no download for Samsung or LG TVs. Sadly, for these, you will need to use an external device that plugs into your TV. For example, a PC, Amazon Fire Stick, or a Raspberry Pi. Speaking of which, if you do have a Raspberry Pi, you can use Libra Elect, which is a Linux distro based on Kodi. When it comes to using Surfshark with Kodi, it's dead simple. Head over to Surfshark.com and click the login button located in the top right. Then just enter your details and continue. Next, simply download the Surfshark app for your device that you have Kodi on. After downloading it, install Surfshark. And that's it. Just log into the app and start connecting to various locations around the world. If you are using Libra Elec on a Raspberry Pi, then the process will be a bit more complicated. In that case, you'll have to use something called a Zomboid VPN manager. I will include a full written step-by-step -step tutorial in the description below on how to do that if you're interested. And that is everything you need to know on how to use Surfshark with Kodi. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe for more videos just like this. And hey, if you want to know how to use Surfshark on your TV, then check out one of these videos right beside me. But that's all from me. Take care.